if you already have the service revolver and it's already in Savala's a loot pool for you, this video is clearly not for you. If you didn't ever complete the Triumph back in Season 6 or never actually got the service revolver back in Season 3 when it originally dropped, then this video is for you. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and like thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out and subscribe if you're new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos. Excuse my voice by the way, I am full of a cold and it's telling me a new one. Okay, so the service revolver was originally a weapon which made an appearance back in season 3. But came back in season 6 with Savala and this required you to complete the season 6 completions triumph. Which back in season 6 required you to complete 40 strikes. In doing this, Savala had one on offer which you could purchase after doing these strikes. Doing the 40 strikes back in season 6 also added the service revolver into the vanguard loop wall, meaning you could get it at the end of strikes, at the end of nightfall and from Savala various engram package level ups. Now if you did neither of the unlocking it within season 3 or doing the 40 strikes in season 6, it is believed you can't get this to drop. I was led to believe there was a bug within the system stopping it from dropping for those who didn't acquire it but have the strikes done, the 40 required strikes this season. I can confirm this to be true. I am one of the people who never got this weapon. I didn't get it in season 3 and I didn't do the triumph in season 6. The season 6 completion triumphs isn't even within my triumphs page. And I remember as when I come back last season towards the end, I blame Apex for that, and seeing the actual triumph. I was going to do it but I was told there's no point because next season you'll be able to get it either way. Well months later and hundreds of strikes later, nothing has dropped. Well that people was until the other day. The service revolver actually dropped for me and this happened at the end of my 134th strike which is triple the original requirement of 40 strikes. Now after a little research many people had the exact same issue of never getting this weapon. One person I saw had completed over 400 strikes and never got it. Well after further research it seems the bug was fixed with the solstice patch and the service revolver for those who did never have it can now get it to drop at the end of strikes even nightfalls. I'm willing to bet you though that you will still have to do at least 40 strikes this season to see it drop. So that's what you gotta do people. If you already have done 40 strikes this season, farm, farm and farm more strikes until you get the service revolver to drop. When that happens, I'm pretty certain Savala so adds it to his package loot pool, which means you can use those Vanguard tokens and hopefully land yourself a perfect roll. This is the hand cannon many people by the way believe is better than the Lunars and are not forgotten. I will make my opinion on that when I actually get a better roll. But until then people I'm going to farm more now, I know the bug has been resolved and it's now in my loot pool after getting it from the end of a strike. So yeah people, this is how you get the service revolver in season 7 if you've never had the weapon before. Do at least 40 strikes and then after that I believe it's added to the strike loot pool. Complete more strikes until you get one to drop, then it's added to Zavala's loot pool, meaning you can get it from the Ingram City offers for Vanguard tokens. But on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. I apologise again about my voice. This cold is absolutely killing me. But on that note, we are out. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, really helps. Uh, if you're new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video, upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell. Bottom, but guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.